problem solver. Becoming a proficient problem solver involves honing the combination of skills such as analytical thinking, creativity, and emotional intelligence. One foundational step is to develop an analytical mindset as being able to dissect a problem into its constituent parts makes it more manageable. For instance, in software engineering, debugging a complex application becomes more tractable when you isolate specific modules or functions to test individually. By segmenting a large issue into smaller pieces, you can more readily identify the root cause and fix it. Engineers at Google, for example, often employ a divide and conquer strategy, using tools like binary search debugging to isolate problem areas in an efficient manner. In addition to analytical skills, creative thinking is crucial for problem solving. This means thinking outside the box and exploring unconventional solutions. The invention of post-it notes serves as a compelling example. While attempting to develop a strong adhesive, Spencer Silver, a chemist at 3M, created a weak one instead. It was Art Fry, another 3M scientist, who creatively thought of using this failed adhesive to make bookmarks for his hymnal, eventually leading to the creation of post-it notes. Creativity can thus transform what appears to be a problem or failure into an innovative solution. Techniques like brainstorming sessions or using mind maps can help foster this kind of creative thinking. Furthermore, collaboration and teamwork often open new avenues for problem solving. When multiple perspectives converge on a single issue, the range of potential solutions expands. Ray Dalio, founder of the investment firm Bridgewater Associates, institutionalized a culture of radical transparency to foster collective problem solving. By encouraging honest dialogue and debate, the team can arrive at more robust solutions than any individual could achieve alone. Consider harnessing the power of collaboration by tapping into diverse skill sets and perspectives within your organization or peer group. Emotional intelligence is another often overlooked aspect of problem solving. Understanding the emotional and social dimensions of a problem can provide unique insights into how to solve it. For example, Customer complaints aren't just logistical problems, but also emotional ones. A skilled problem solver will not only address the issue, but also manage the customer's dissatisfaction, possibly converting a disgruntled customer into a loyal one. Professionals in customer service roles frequently employ these multifaceted problem-solving skills. Importantly, a good problem solver also knows when to take a step back and evaluate the progress. Reflective thinking can provide valuable insights into the effectiveness of the chosen solution strategy. For instance, medical professionals often employ this tactic, known as the PLANDO Study Act PDSA, cycle, to improve patient outcomes. After implementing a treatment plan, they will analyze results, study data, and adjust their approach accordingly. Finally, Resilience and perseverance are essential traits for effective problem solving. Consider the case of Thomas Edison, who famously made thousands of unsuccessful attempts before finally inventing a functional light bulb. His resilience demonstrates that problem solving often involves overcoming numerous failures and setbacks. To sum up, becoming an adept problem solver requires a blend of analytical thinking, creative innovation, collaborative effort, emotional intelligence, reflective assessment, and sheer resilience. By consciously developing these attributes and applying them to real-world challenges, you'll be well-equipped to tackle problems both simple and complex.